Hey guys, this is Argon657 here with another Pokemon Ors Wi-Fi battle. This battle is against Carson, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I'm going to start off with my Ariados, and he's going to start off with his Slowbro. Um, I'm going to go for a Sticky Web, because seeing his team, it's likely going to be um, pretty fast, some of his Pokemon. So I figured um, Sticky Web would slow them down. A little bit. So, I'm gonna go to my Quagsire. And he's gonna go for a Calm Mind, but the Calm Mind will not affect Quagsire because of Unaware. So, I'm just gonna take that Psyshock pretty nicely and just hit that Slowbro with a Toxic. So, now it's pretty much useless even with Regenerate because it'll eventually rack up. So, uh, he's gonna go to his Chansey to try and heal Bell it away, I'm guessing, but, um, I'm gonna go for an Earthquake, just to see how much damage it does. It does pitiful damage. So, I'm gonna switch on to my Metacham, and he makes a nice play. Go for a Toxic. Um... To hit the Quagsire and also hit whatever Pokemon I switch into. But I'm going to Mega Evolve and I'm actually going to make a misclick. I actually meant to go for a Drain Punch. Because um, I would have had the chance to take it out but I'm not sure. But now I'm going to go to my Haxorus after Metacham goes down. And I see the counter so I'm going to go for a Dragon Dance. Expecting another counter. Um, he's he's going to go for that soft-boiled again. Well, not again. But he's going to go for that soft-boiled. And I'm going to go for a second Dragon Dance. And now I'm at plus two. And I'm hoping that um, the Brick Break will be enough to take it out. Unfortunately, it's not enough. Just a couple HP uh, short. So, he's going to be able to get off that Toxic and just poison my Haxorus. And Brick Break was not enough, even after plus two. And even after it beat an Admit and everything, but it's not Stab, so that's why it wasn't enough to take it out. I'm guessing Outrage, but I didn't want to be locked into Outrage because Talonflame has Brave Bird and Gale Wings, so that's why. Um, I'm gonna go to my Quagsire, because it's like the only thing that can uh, take moves from Talonflame. And he's gonna go for the U-turn and go to his Slowbro, and I'm expecting him to uh, U-turn, so I would go for a Recover, which I do. Um, he's gonna go for, no, I'm going to switch out into my Magnezone, and he's going to go for a Scald, and unfortunately, he gets the burn. Um, I'm going to go for that Choice Specs Thunderbolt. No, I think I'm going to go for a Vault Switch over here to uh, get the Switch Advantage, and it's going to be an easy KO on the Slowbro. So now I'm going to go to my Ar um, Ariados. Um, he's going to go to his Scrafty. And now i got to switch out because I want to preserve the Focus Sash. He's going to go for the Dragon Dance. The Dragon Dance will not affect me because I have Unaware. So he can Dragon Dance all the way to plus 6. But it's going to uh, be neutral damage. So um, I get the burn off. So that's cool. So now the um, Scrafty is pretty much useless. Even after getting all those Dragon Dances up. Especially uh, against a Quagsire. Um, I'm going to go for that Earthquake. And luckily I get a crit. So he's going to go for a Drain Punch. And that does pitiful damage. So now... He's going to 
get um, life orb damage, and even if I didn't go for a skull, the burn would be enough to take it out, so it wouldn't matter in the long run. So now he's going to go to his Manek trick, and he's going to get the sticky web and everything, and I'm guessing it's Mega um, Manek trick, and I'm hoping that he doesn't carry Hidden Power Grass or some sort. Even though most Manetrix usually have Hidden Power Ice, I just wanted to see if he had Hidden Power Grass or Ice. Um, it turns out he's going to have Hidden Power Ice, so he's going to take out my Haxorus. I'm going to go to my Ariadel, so now I can just hit it with uh, Cross Poison, because I know I have Focus Sash, and I can go for a Sucker Punch to get more damage. And he's going to take me out with a Thunderbolt, but it's already at low HP, so I'm going to be able to go to my Typhlosion, which is Choice Scarfed, and I'm going to be able to just finish him off with an Eruption. So he's going to go into his Talonflame, and I'm not going to stay in on a Talonflame, especially if I'm Scarfed, because I'm locked into Eruption, so... Uh, I'm going to go to my Quagsire. He's going to go for the Brave Bird. And get some leftovers recovery, but the Brave Bird does a lot. Um, he's going to go for another Brave Bird. And I'm going to go for a Recover. To try to um, uh, stall him out. Recoil stall him. But he's going to go for another Brave Bird once again and it's not gonna do that much um, I'm gonna go for a recover again and I was expecting him to go for a brave bird again but I should have seen the um, no he doesn't go for the roost this turn but he goes for another brave bird and I go for another recover and over here is when he goes for a roost and I was expecting him to uh, no Never mind, never mind. Um, no, wait. It doesn't take him out. The recoil. I'm going to go for that recovery. And over here is when he goes for the roost. And I was expecting him to just go for that brave bird once again. Um, he was going to go for a roost again. So I'm going to go for a scald. I wasn't sure if he was going to go for a brave bird. So that's why I didn't go for an earthquake. So, in case he roosted, I could have predicted that and gone for that Earthquake. But, I'm just going to go for a Scald over here. I'm not going to bother recovering. So, I'm just going to take out this Talonflame. Um, okay, so, now he's going to go to his Scizor, his last Pokemon. So, now, um, he's going to go for his Sword Stance. And, like I said, unaware... Uh, Quagsire, uh, it will not, um, uh, be affected with the stat boost and everything, so, um, I'm gonna switch out into my Magda, so I'm kinda realizing that it's gonna take, uh, a while to take out the Scizor, especially how much damage that did to, uh, the Scizor, the Skull did so little. Um, so I'm just going to go to my Magnezone and just take it out with a Hidden Power of Fire. So, good game. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Just comment, like, subscribe, and I will see you guys later.